hi guys, welcome to my workshop and to part two of building our own table tennis racket. In the last part we um, cut some super thin veneers on the bandsaw. Oh my god. Look at this. It's so beautiful. If you're interested in something like that, just check out the video. And now we're ready for the glue up. And here I got everything I need. So uh, I got some cling foam to cover these plates. And between those I will press down um, the racket. Then we got our template. We got our centerpiece, which is poplar. Then we add some fiberglass. Then we have two layers of uh, polonia and two layers of mahogany. Um, some cork and some bamboo for the handle. Um, some epoxy and some sanding paper just to smooth out um, the saw marks. And of course, I bought some rubber and a special glue for it. Yeah, and these forms I will clamp down on my welding table, because it's super straight. Just like that.
Okay, now it's done. As you can see, I had a lot of squeeze out. Uh, and with the rest of the glue, I just added a coat on the workbench so nothing is wasted. Okay, now we're done. Tomorrow we can uh, unclamp it and <laughs> hopefully we get a good result. And now I'll clean my tools and then I will do some other stuff. See you tomorrow. Well, uh, yeah, cleaning off my tools. Uh, it showed me again how much I hate epoxy. I bought, uh, bought those two bottles around five years ago. And um, of course I don't throw them away. I will use them, but I will never buy epoxy in my life again in such an amount. Um, just uh, those little things for special glue ups. Another thing, so much trash. Stupid past Constantine. Oh, it's so much better than I thought. Okay. Epoxy doesn't stick to. Um, forgot the word. Well, let's just see how thick it is because it's uh, thicker than a normal table tennis bed. One point, uh, zero point eight. So it's kind of one point five millimeter thicker than uh, the thickest wood I've found. But probably that's good for me. I don't know. Oh, it really looks great. So hopefully this is enough, but look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten layers of wood. Eight millimeters. Pretty nice. And it's plenty enough. So I just cut out the template. Um, I choose the, the medium blade size. It's a little bit wider than my old one. And I also extended the handle a little bit to, yeah, just a little bit bigger. Yeah, feels right. Okay, now we glue it on there <clears throat> with some spray glue and then we can cut it out. nice okay now we have to sand everything smooth and then I will make the handle out of bamboo and maybe a piece of cork as well like this and here I have to glue on some uh, mahogany probably we will see So 
So I already pre-cutted everything um, and that's the plan. We take a piece of cork, then we glue on a piece of bamboo and on the left and on the right side we glue on a piece of mahogany, like this. Um, then we pre-shape everything, glue it on the racket and then we will finish the shape and then we glue on the rubber and we can play table tennis. Nice. Let's go. Oh, sorry, my SD card was full just at the beginning of the gluing process, so um, now it's done because I didn't want to waste the glue. Um, yeah, I packed it up in oops, some foil. And yeah, so let's unpack them real quick. Uh, here they are. Okay, now we'll just pre-shape them. So I just glued the handle on. <coughs> uh, two hours ago and, <laughs> and this is how I clamped it. That was genius. So. Okay, already not too bad. Um, so we'll hit it with the belt sander first um, to bring it in some shape and then I will finish it off with the orbital sander. It's done, so I just have to put on the rubber. Then I will hit the handle and the side part with um, hard wax oil. And then we'll show you the finished racket. Oh, I'm so pleased with that. There was so much potential to fuck this up at several points. And it's pretty nice. And look at this. Nice pattern. Oh yeah, and that process takes a while because after you applied the glue on uh, both things, you have to wait 10 to 15 minutes before you put them together.
so hi guys thanks for watching um here it is my own table tennis record 10 layers eight layers of wood two layers fiberglass bamboo cork mahogany handle um really like how it came out feels good to hold it in, in my hand and i can't wait to see how it performs uh, i don't know when i can play but probably next week and i will do a video of that as well well unique swords have a name so i think this one needs a name as well and if you have any good suggestions just let me know in the comments um yeah and like comment or subscribe to this channel to be part of my journey of crafting everything I came up with. I think I have uh, around about 60 other videos right now on my channel. Just check them out. See you on another project. Bye.